Hey guys, I'm back. So today I'm going to be talking about um, ways to test USB gadgets you've built. I know I have lots of videos about USB, iPod chargers, car chargers, phone chargers, battery charger, well, using batteries to charge anything over USB. I don't have a lot of videos like that. So, um, well, like three or four, really. But anyway, this is just something that I've uh, not really built, but have used a lot that is really helpful in testing them. So you want to know, like, say, in testing them, like, what, what is the voltage? Is it really giving me 5 volts? Are my data lines at the correct voltage to give it a charge? Um, and you don't really want to pull the, um, you know, the, uh, you don't want to test the voltage directly from the voltage regulator itself. You want to test it from the USB plug. But you can't really stick, you know, your multimeter probes into those little slots on the um, USB, into the slots on, you know, the female USB connector or something, right? So you can't really get the direct voltage from the USB, so you don't know if something's wrong with the connector or anything. This will help you solve that problem. What we have here is a USB on one end, and then I've just stripped the cable, and on the other end I've put, um, I've just tinned the wires. Tinning is when you just uh, put your soldering iron on the wire, and then you add some solder, and it just makes it all solid, and, um, you can easily solder these to anything. Anyway, I've tinned everything. Um, the shielding, power cables, and the ground are all tinned, and nothing's done to the connector side, right? So now if you need to measure the voltage, you just measure the voltage on the power lines. If you need to measure the, um, you know, make sure it's 5 volts. If you need to measure your uh, the voltage for your data, like for the iPod, it needs to be like 2 volts, 2.1 volts. You can, you have your data lines here uh, open, you know? Um, you need to test the shielding for some reason. You have the shield open for resistance testing. So anyway, it's it's really simple to use. You just plug it in and use it. You could even try it on your computer, although not recommended, because um, uh, your computer doesn't like plugging in things that aren't um, real, so to speak. There's not no real circuitry here. But anyway, it's a really nice um, test to just hook up this and just, you know, make sure that nothing's wrong with your circuitry from your voltage regulator to your connector, and nothing's wrong with, you know, your connector. So, that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. This is a relatively simple one, but I hope that um, it is useful. So, you know, just get a spare USB cable. I have like a bajillion of them, so, you know. Alright, so thanks for watching. Bye.